Hi everybody, welcome back to CrossFit Roseville Fawn Family Home Edition. Hope you guys are doing great. Um, we have another fun workout today. So um, let's just get started. We're gonna, let me actually talk about this for a second. We are gonna go quick through this. We're gonna go some fast feet. Okay, fast feet, it's fast feet for you. Okay, um, so we're gonna come here. So I'm going out, out, in, in, little quick steps, but I'm really, you know, I'm moving my arms, moving my legs, all right? Squats, we're gonna go three, two, one, tempo squats. So what that's gonna look like, we're gonna go a three count down, we're gonna hold for a two count, and we're gonna come up for a count. So it's gonna look like this, one, two, three, one, two, one. Okay, so three down, pull for two, come up for one. Okay, when you're coming up on that one, you wanna come up, squeeze your glutes, all right? So one more time, it looks like this. Three, two, one, one, two, one. Three, two, one, one, two, one. Okay? Push-ups. Um, I'm gonna give you some options on push-ups today. Um, I really like pretty push-ups. Um, here we do them nice and tight. Um, so we're in this good position, full range of motion, okay? Um, so I'm gonna give you a couple options. You can go from your knees, okay? Keeping that core tight. Now notice I'm going from my knees, but it's full range of motion, okay? That might be where you stay, that's awesome, okay? Um, you, can go, you can go from your feet here, okay? I would like you to go full range of motion, no saggy backs, no rears in the air, okay? Um, if the first one is relatively easy, and maybe um, going from your feet is super hard. Uh, we can meet in the middle. So you're gonna go one foot down, okay? I'm keeping my, hold on one second. I'm keeping my, um, my foot up. My hips are square. Okay, so it's a little tougher than two feet, but not quite as tough from two feet. And it's just a little different. Okay, um, you might feel that in your, in your glute too, okay? So you've got some options on the push-ups. Side plank rotations, we're just gonna go from a high plank here, we're gonna rotate up, okay? Then we're gonna do a hollow hold on our stomach, okay, so that's gonna look like this, okay? My feet are together, uh, my Hands are fully extended, my arms are fully extended, my spine is neutral. Okay, you're gonna hold it there, that's what the tummy looks like. Then we're gonna go onto our back. Same thing, gonna make sure that bottom of our, of our, um, our lower back is flat to the ground. And we're gonna hold here, okay? Now we've talked about uh, hollow holds on our back before. If you cannot get in this position, with your back on the ground. You can be here, okay? You can be here, all right? So you can be here, 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 all right? Those are no joke. So if those are a challenge, um, that's okay. They should be a challenge. That means you're doing it right. Okay, so here we go. Uh, we're gonna go about 30 seconds on each thing, I'm gonna say about because I'm gonna to try to really hard to see the clock. We'll see how this goes. So we're gonna start off with 30 seconds fast feet. Now remember, fast feet, it's all relative, okay? So if your fast isn't that fast, no worries. Just get moving. All right, so we're going fast feet, out, out, in, in. We're going in five seconds. Three, two, one, here we go. And I'm moving my arms, guys. So get those arms, quick little feet. Okay, we're 
we're gonna go three, two, one. Now we're gonna go our three, two, one squats. One, two, three, one, two, up. One, two, three, one, two, up. Three, two, one, two, one, one. So our last one. And up. All right, push-ups. Here we go. We're going 20 seconds, guys. Three, two, one. All right, side plank rotations. About five more seconds. And then we're gonna go into a hollow hold on our tummy. And here we go, drop on down, hollow hold, neutral spine. Feet are together, point those toes. 10 more seconds. And then we're gonna flip to our backs. Five, four, three, two, one, to our backs. Sorry, switch around so I can see. 15 more seconds. 10 seconds. Five, Four, three, two, one, relax. All right, guys, that was two minutes. I'm gonna give you a little bit of rest and then we're gonna go through that one more time. Um, so push-ups, you probably noticed I just stayed from my knees. Um, that, that actually was a really good warm-up for me. It felt great. Um, so I'll probably stay there. Um, Everything else, that look good. So here we go. Let's, we'll go in 10 seconds. 10 seconds. We're gonna go 20 seconds each movement. Here we go, ready and fast feet. Fifteen seconds. 10 seconds. Go fast. Five, four, three, two, one, and our three, two, one squats. Two, two, Five seconds. Two, one. All right, push ups. That's our next thing. Here we go. Actually, I'm going to try to go one knee. If you're going one knee, switch sides. Or if you're going from your knees or your feet, that's great. All right. Now we're going to plank rotations. And make sure that wrist is straight under your shoulder. All right, and hollow hold on your stomach. Five seconds. And switch to your back. This is our last thing. drink um nicely done on that that took us we're right almost to the five minute mark um so nicely done um if you feel like you need more of a warm-up and you want to go through that a third time you are more than welcome to do that just hit stop and uh, go for it okay i'm going to go over this workout um here's what we have going today we are 
Everything is 40 seconds on, 20 seconds off, okay? Um, it's three times through, but you're gonna go all the way through one, all the way through, that's two, all the way through, that's three, okay? Um, the way this is gonna work, you're gonna go 40 on, 20 off. 40 on, 20 off. You're gonna go right into this guy. 40 on, 20 off. 40 on, 20 off. 40 on, 20 off. 40 on, 20 off. And then you're gonna rest a minute, okay? That's, that's round one, okay? After your one minute rest is up, then you're back here. Same thing. So um, you keep cycling through. This workout is going to be 2, 4, 6, 7, 14, 21, so really 20 minutes. Okay, this is a 20 minute workout with some rest in between. All right, so um, high low plank. We've done that before. You're going to start off um, in a high plank. Make sure those wrists are right under your shoulders. Okay, keep that back nice and straight, nice and flat, and you're going to come down and right back up. Down, down, up, up, down, down, up, up. You're more than welcome to alternate each time if you want, okay? So totally up to you. Um, that's our high-low plank. Then you're gonna switch over onto your back and you're gonna go some bicycles, okay? So remember with these, this, my leg goes full extension, okay? So I'm going knee to elbow, but I'm kicking that leg out. Okay, and when I kick it out, it does not hit the ground. It's here. Okay, burpees. We all know burpees. We all love burpees. Um, we talked about these modifications lots of times, but um, here's a full, uh, a full RX burpee here. Um, all the way down, all the way up. When I go down, my chest needs to hit, my belly needs to hit my hips and legs need to hit, okay? It does not have to be pretty. Um, the whole goal is get down, get up. Um, so I'll show you what that looks like. All the way down, all the way up, and a clap. Okay? Um, so you saw the not so pretty on the way down, right? It does not have to be a controlled, beautiful movement. We're just getting down, getting back up. Um, Another option, if that's not happening today, um, you can step, step, come down, step, step, and then either jump or not, okay? So step, step, okay? If that's not happening, you can stop here. Okay, so three different options for the burpees, okay? Now remember, when your 40 seconds is up, you're done. You get rest, okay? So um, if you can do, you wanna, you wanna try to you know, challenge yourself with where you're at. And maybe you know, a, really, a really fast, um, a fast person that's really good at burpees, they might get, I'm just gonna throw a number out there, they might get 10 in and maybe you only get five in, but five is, that's where, that's where you're starting, so that's okay. So challenge yourself, and don't worry about what anybody else is doing, all right? Overhead squats. Um, we are going to do our regular squats today, but we are gonna hold something overhead, okay? So we are gonna be in this position, okay? Um, I am gonna grab, I should have done this before, Hold on one second. Sorry guys, um, I have a PVC here. So I'm gonna put this right over the middle of my head, right over the middle of my, um, my arch here. So right over the middle of my head straight up, okay? So I'm gonna do my regular squat, keeping my chest up, and something overhead, okay? So this is what it looks like. Um, we've done squats in here lots of times. So chest is up, my armpits are forward, 
Um, and I'm really trying to get that full depth with my chest up. Um, and it does not have to be a heavy weight, guys. This, obviously, not very heavy. Um, and some of us are gonna have a really difficult time getting, um, you know, getting, getting full depth, okay? If you can't quite get there, that's okay. You just know that's something that you need to work on. Um, so you could use this. Um, you could use something like this, okay? So something like this is an option. I should have grabbed this to begin with. Um, you know, if you have something like this, you could go here. Okay, now when you're doing these, just remember you don't want to be doing this. Okay, you want this guy to stay over your head, keeping the integrity of the movement. All right, so chest is here, core is tight, my hips go back and down, my knees track out, I squeeze my glutes. Okay, so you never want to be doing this, right? So check my knees. This is good position, not good position. That didn't even feel good. Um, so you've got all sorts of options. You could even grab a towel, um, like a back towel, hold the towel. Um, just look around your house, um, be creative. It doesn't need to be heavy guys at all. Obviously none of these items are heavy, but um, Going overhead with something, you're definitely going to feel a difference, all right? Um, so sorry, I didn't have those ahead of time. Swimmers. Um, who doesn't love to do swimmers? We're going to get on our tummies, and we're going to keep that core tight. Now I'm kicking my legs, and I'm moving my arms. My arms are nice and straight, okay? So this is going to be a total body movement. I'm going to feel it in my shoulders. I'm going to be feeling it here, and then um, I'm going to feel it in my glutes because my feet are not touching the ground. I mean, they're touching, but they're not hanging out, right? So I'm constantly moving. Um, after our swimmers, we're going to go into speed skaters, okay? So speed skater is here, all right? Now, if you want to be challenged, you're going to go really quick, and you can also touch. Okay, so um, with the speed skater, um, pick where you want to be, all right? Uh, number one, move quick. That's the whole idea. And remember, quickness is all relative. Uh, we're all at different phases of our life and fitness level and age and all that good stuff. Um, but the more challenging, you want to be quicker and, you know, you want to touch the ground, that's great. If you don't want to touch the ground, um, because either... You can't do that or you're, you've got mobility issues or this is like fitness is all new. You're gonna be fine just being here, okay? Um, so I am gonna go through this. I'm gonna go through one round with you, all right? Um, and then you'll be on your own. So you will want a clock um, or you can always stop and rewind and do it again two more times. Um, or, um, you know, we talked about the smart timer or the wad timers, the different apps that can actually um, make it super easy and they alert you when your time is almost up and then when to start again. I'm gonna run us on a 40 second on, 20 second off clock. And then we'll be all set. So get a drink of water, guys. Um, get your your item that you're gonna use for overhead squats and then we'll get going here in just a second. And kids, don't grab anything breakable. And if you're not sure what to grab, ask mom or dad. Here we go. And remember, 
it's 40 seconds, right? So you're, the idea is to get in as many reps or to move as fast as you can in 40 seconds because you're gonna get 20 seconds rest immediately after that. Okay, so go hard for 40 and then, you know, rest for 20. All right, we're going in 10. We are starting off with our high, low plank. And if you need a towel for this, guys, that's okay. Here we go, 40 seconds. Keep that back nice and straight. Make sure your wrists are coming right under your shoulders. Halfway. I'm going to switch to my other side now. Good job, everybody. Going in 10 seconds. Don't forget, elbow to knee. Kick that leg out. Three, two, one, go. Remember, guys, we're going fast. 30 seconds left. Kick that leg out. burpees everybody's favorite so remember pick your most challenging option and then just move as, as quick as you can for 40 seconds that's it three two one go Going in 10 seconds. All right, five, four, three, two, one. Good. Check your feet. Keep your chest up. Core is tight, knees are out. Remember, if you can't get full depth, you're just going to try to get as low as you can with good form. Knees are out, chest is up. Five, four, three, two, one. Nice job, guys. All right, swimmers. Going in 10 seconds. All right, going in five, three, two, one, and go. Straight legs, straight arms, those toes barely tap down. Try to have neutral spine. Speed skater. 
Inhale's next. We have 15 seconds left of rest. We get to rest a minute after this, guys. Here we go. Five, four, three, two, one, and go. 40 seconds and then we get to rest. today guys um take care of your bodies take care of yourself take care of each other um make sure you go through this two more times you can always rewind if you want to stay on my clock or use your own all right have a great day guys <laughs>